This video was designed to demonstrate the ease of use of our coalescing product, the BDC. To begin, we must provide a better understanding of our coalescing product. Coalescing is a process by which two or more droplets merge during contact to form a single droplet, bubble, or particle. In a fuel application, a coalescing medium is employed in order that larger droplets are formed. Larger, heavier water droplets sink in the lighter oil and can be collected in a sump and drained. Schroeder's coalescing element is designed to have inside out flow to optimize the coalescing effect. Contaminated fuel enters at the bottom of the element passing through the coalescing layer. Clean, dry fuel passes through the downstream hydrophobic barrier as water droplets are then repelled by this barrier and fall into the element chamber. Water is collected in the filter housing sump and the water level can be seen on the visual gauge and discharge automatically or manually. All Schroeder coalescing elements are designed under test method SAE 1488. With this test standard, we are able to prove our 99.5% single pass efficiency rate. The bulk diesel filter cart consists of new fuel slash water separation media technology and a three phase element construction for high efficiency single pass removal of free water. This product can be used in single pass fuel dispensing or multi pass reservoir cleanup and continuous maintenance. It can be applied upstream suction side or downstream pressure side of transfer pumps. This product also consists of a bag housing for larger particulate, microbial bloom, and or rust removal from your fuel. Here's a prime example of samples taken after each filtration stage with your end result under 25 parts per million. Today we are out here to demonstrate uh, BDC. This is a modified version without the bag housing and the, the particle element is right here. The purpose for this is just to uh, show you how well our coalescing capabilities are. Uh, we have our water source right here. The reason for the tank being tilted on its side is because we're going to add 3.7 liters of water. If we were to add 3.7 liters of water on a 50 gallon tank, it would flatten on the bottom and be a little bit harder to collect. So we're going to give it a pocket of water in the far corner. I'm going to go ahead and begin.